It was a juxtapole-like operation when the committee saddled with the evacuation of vagabonds on the street went to business in Ilorin. John Gospower is a well-known mentally challenged man, having been roaming about the metropolis for over 10 years. Though he was not known to be violent, the expertise with which the catcher got him caught my attention. I don't know the name of these people. I know that he is a uh, star of Raymond. But yeah, it's, it's Lagos. All right, um, where are they taking you to? Me, I'm waiting for aeroplane to carry me <laughs> to back to uh, where I came from. I'm smoking the IM, so they, they catch, it, catch it off my hand. I, I learned weather. Mm -hmm. As I finished weather, I, go, I went there, I go smoke. So my father said that I should be there, smoke. If I come, I will shoot me. That's what why. What do you smoke? Oh, no, no, no. Leaf, original leaf. The committee set up by government is headed by the owner of a private traditional psychiatric home for long show salu. As much as the vagabond sends danger, citing the members of the committee. Kuala State government is evacuating lunatic and uh, street beggars in order not to spread the coronavirus COVID-19. Along with that psychiatric home where they are relocated is a private initiative with which the government is collaborating. The condition at which Inmates live at Olonoda Psychiatric Home is nothing to write home about, but the collaboration becomes inevitable as the government rehabilitation center is under renovation. There is a need for us to evacuate the lunatic and the destitute that are moving around before because if these people can be attacked by this COVID-19, it can easily spread out so that we don't want our people to, to, to involve in this. The inmates sleep on bare floor without mattress and the home is not connected to public electricity supply. The center is open to external attack without a perimeter fencing while the only motorized borrow available is shared with members of the host community. The initiator of the home, Foloncho Salu, who led the evacuation, inherited the skill and converted it to charity work. We want government to do perimeter fencing of the center for smooth operation. We also need the support in the area of feeding. We are going to do some of the support in the area of feeding. We are going to do some of the support in the area of feeding. We are going to do some of the For the beggars, they are restricted to Gambari area, a neighborhood where they are mostly populated in the capital. The idea of evacuating the mentally challenged people and beggars from the streets in the state capital is a preventive measure in view of the possibility of these wanderers transmitting the deadly coronavirus.